Hey man, attack everything today. Yeah. Hey, play aggressive. Hey, don't, don't hold anything back. Leave it all on the field today. Let's go. Win on three. One, two, three. Win. Game time. No words. I'm ready to play. When we walk out of this locker room, we walk out with 70 guys that are ready to go damn attack. You play this game with an edge. That's the way you win football games. And you do it over and over and over again. And you don't accept anything less. You know why? Because the guy damn next to you. Now let's walk out of here, 70 guys, with one purpose, one heartbeat. Week six of the 2017 college football season found the Ole Miss Rebels on the plains of Auburn. An offense that struggled one week earlier in Tuscaloosa would come out swinging on their first possession. Caught! That's a tight end toss to Knox. He's got a first down and plenty more. That big boy, that's a big boy, man! Distance and off the post, no good. Unfazed by the early miss, the Rebels would go right back to work. Patterson has a man wide open, hits route 35. Caught there by Jefferson, makes a move to get around a guy and gets all the way down to near the 20 yard line. Hey, hey, offense hit the score right here. Hey, D, you gotta do a great job. Let's go three and out. Five of eight on the year. And he fits it through to get Ole Miss on the board. The early Rebel score would prove to be their only points of the half, with a stingy Auburn defense limiting Patterson and company. The Tigers, on the other hand, used an early big play to build momentum. He's got the sideline. Ryan Davis, first class speed, and he bends it back to the inside. Davis looking for a block. Got it! And Davis will take it 75 yards for the score. When the gun sounded to end half one, the Plainsmen of Auburn had built an impressive 35 to three lead. All right, listen up, listen up. I want this second half of this game to be the turning point of our season. You understand what I'm saying? I want you, I want you to go out and I want you to win this second half. I want you to come out the second half and fight. And when you walk off that field, you walk off knowing you left everything on the damn field. One stop, one touchdown at a time. Go get a stop, then go score. Then get a stop, then go score. That's how you win games. Make this second half of this game the turning point of this season. And go win this half. Go win this half. And fight back. Fight back. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. One up top. Oh, one up top. Stop, stop, man. Man. Hey, we got to get the D up. Hey, we got to get the D up, though. We got to get the D up. Defense! 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 Fake the handoff, quick pass out to that back receiver. Good job by the Rebels. A little life on that old Miss sideline, too. Looking off the right side, runs into three guys. Had him try to spin out of there and go back the other way. One at a time, baby. Keep tipping, James. Keep tipping away, baby. Land Shark defense was swarming in the second half, tightening with their backs against the wall and holding the number 12 team in the country to field goal tries. With the defense holding fast, their offensive counterpart looked to finish what they started in the first half. Fake to Jordan Wilkins, deep down the right side, he's got A.J. Brown caught and hauled into the 40, hand off to Wilkins, and he goes off the right side, tries to keep his balance, gets in by the 10, knocked down at the nine yard line. It's a nine yard game. He's gonna pass, a little hitch route of the five, spinning free and stepping into the end zone is DK Metcalf, and that ends the drought. That's a positive drive right there for Shea Patterson, finishing off with six points. Put a smile on your face, we having fun. We having fun now. Be tired after the game, they can't handle it. We got to do this the rest of the half, and we'll score the rest of the half. Keep fighting, stay in it, stay in it. All right, hey, let's go get another one now. Everybody keep fighting and play your butts off. You got it? Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Fake on the handoff. 
Got Jefferson across the middle, makes the catch at the 40 of Auburn, breaks one tackle, then wrestled down. And now a handoff. Wilkins got some room off the right side. He's to the 25, 20, 15, 10, and knocked out of bounds inside the 10-yard line around the eight. Good run there. Patterson works it to Metcalf. And Metcalf hurdles his way in. Touchdown, Ole Miss. Positive plays. Young team can turn even in the back half of this game into positive opportunities to build on things. A rebel offense that had found itself searching for answers suddenly seemed to have found them using their tempo to wear on the Tiger defenders. Swing pass out the far side to Wilkins. Wilkins to the 25-30, cuts back to the middle of the field, gets the 35-40, and knocked off his feet there. Nice catch and run. There's a snap to Patterson, swings it out to Wilkins. Wilkins running hard, has the first down, the 10, he's the 5, and gets close to the goal line, knocked off his feet. Man on man. Auburn stacked in tight, first and goal at the 1. There's a handoff to Wilkins. Wilkins gets in the end zone. Nice job blocking on that right side. He went in. Pretty much untouched for the score. Way to compete this second half, man. Way to compete this second half. Way to compete this second half. All of them. Way to compete this second half. We got the stuff we got to clean up, but we are a damn good team, okay? We got to play all together at the same time, but we got some good qualities. We got to put this stuff together. We got to compete to get to a, game, a great game plan. Y'all got to keep believing, taking care of the small things, and we're going to be fine, okay? We got and the next one. The only game that's important is the next one, okay? We're ready. In the end, the Auburn lead was too much to surmount, but the Rebels would leave the field knowing that they had indeed answered the call of their coach. The second half had belonged to the Rebels, outscoring Auburn 20 to nine. Y'all bring it in tight. Bring it in tight. Let's start off by saying I love you guys. Love you too, coach. Hey, hey, you fought. You fought in the second half. This second half is the turning point of our season. You understand me? We have seven games left, five at, five at home, and then two on the road at Kentucky and Mississippi State. But you gotta play with passion, and you gotta play with heart. That's the only way you win in this league. You understand what I'm saying? But this is gonna be the turning point of our season. You listen to what I'm saying. But y'all get ready and go back to work. We got seven more opportunities. We're gonna make the best of every one of them. Hey, I'm proud of you because you didn't go cover up in the second half. Hey, you came out and you fought, and that's what it's gonna take from each and every one of them. Hey, hey, so let's come back and go to work. Hey, and again, I know you're hurting. And I know you ain't into moral victories. But you got to come back and go to work. We're going to build off this second half. It's going to be the turning point. Um, you know, disappointed. Give a lot of credit to Auburn. They, they took it to us in the first half. Um, too many explosive plays. Um, positive. I was proud that uh, I saw a difference in the second half from our team uh, as opposed to last week. Uh, they came out and fought and competed, and we have to build off that moving forward. Y'all told me there's no magical speech, all right? There's no magical adjustment. You got to make your mind to go out and do your job. And they did a phenomenal job the second half of going out, uh, doing their job and holding the field goal. So we want to take that and build off of it. We had an opportunity. We came out. I thought we moved the football. Um, we, had, we had a little bit of tempo going and uh, didn't answer the end of the drive. You know? uh, second half, our guys fought. Coach challenged them to fight at halftime find out what, what our team was really made of, and I think you saw that. I'm ready to get back to the vault, uh, get, you know, take this momentum into, the, into our home crowd. You know, we're really excited, and uh, we're ready to go. 